Hi, I'm Janet Lewis, Rustic Root Sanctuary. I'm the founder and the executive director. The program we launched this year was called From Dreaming to Implementation, and we basically took 10 beginner farmers and showed them everything that we do at Rustic Root Sanctuary so they can launch their own project. So I thought I was gonna bring all these people in to learn about farming, but it turns out what it truly is, is reintroducing people to the land so they can remember. And so instead of learning a new trade, it's like your ancestors speak to you and you're actually remembering what it means to grow your own food, to take care of yourself, to nourish your body and your soul. Number one, uh, the title of the program, From Dreaming to Implementation. I said, oh yeah, that's absolutely what I need. I need to be able to take what's in my heart, in my soul, and have someone show me what to do in order to bring it into fruition. Before I had the idea that it was just a farm program, but it became so much more than that, and it became a community building, a way to see that there's other farmers out here. There's people within the community that's willing to work with farmers, and there's organizations that's all trying to do the same thing around creating and shaping what the future looks like and shaping what change is. And change for me, it happens first with the land. It happens with what we already have and just using that to bring it back to the greater good. And so when they came out with the farmer apprenticeship, I just knew I wanted to do it because I just wanted to kind of formally learn from everybody there and have a space where I can kind of develop what I want to do and make and grow uh, in the community. So I feel like the Farm Dreamer program was just that. It came at the perfect time. I mean, this was really an amazing experience with an amazing group of people. These people have the sweetest, most amazing souls. They're very giving and loving and nurturing. We were all learning together and we all had different levels of capabilities or knowledge, but no one made anyone else feel like, oh, you don't know that. You know, it was great. It was very, very good. Working in the soil, it gives you patience because once you plant a seed, you can't just go back out the next day and expect to see something. So you have to be patient and, and you have to nurture it somewhat like people. You want to be enlightened and you want to enlighten and you want to start in that window of opportunities, especially with our children. Um, you want to introduce kids to chicken nuggets, I'd rather introduce them to the soil and what grows out that soil and what can help them long term in their life. Something that Rustic Group stands by in general and that Janet says all the time is that she wants to help people reconnect with the land and allow the land to heal us and that's always just been a very important principle that's drawn me to this space, to this program, and just to this work in general and I think it's just really important for everyone to just sit with that and just really reconnect themselves to themselves first and then just to the land that's around us. When you're working there, I'm like, okay, I can see, like, this is probably what my great-great-grandmother was doing when she was talking to me about working on a farm. You know, this is probably the work that she put in to put food on the table. We have chefs on the farm. They actually brought the food from the farm to the table and they showed me how this food that was grown in nutritious soil tasted compared to like food that's at the grocery store. It changed my life. And it's not until I actually became a farmer that I actually felt a deep sense of fulfillment. It is the most refreshing thing I've ever done in my entire life. Grow some food, grow anything. I don't care if it's an herb. I don't care if it's just like one little bit of cilantro. I don't care if it's a sunflower, grow something that's going to inspire you to begin to provide your own food for yourself. It is the best thing ever, um, so do it.